Hey everyone, welcome on back. So, as I promised, I, I shouldn't be surprised. As I promised, a battery charger. Can we put it on top of it? Yes, we can. Might as well keep it a little bit uniform. Um, so we now have this as well, which is nice. Uh, now where are our batteries? Um, power cell. I could have sworn we had a bunch of batteries. Here we go. Let's just find as many batteries as we can, stick them in the battery charger, and... Only two more. Uh, okay, so it takes one power to run that. You know, not, not too worried about that one power, but, you know. Okay, any more batteries in here? Nope. Okay, so, with that... We can head out on the highway and go find some stuff. So I had to run around, grab a bunch of copper, and oops. Great start. Great. Just amazing. I, I, I don't understand just how I function sometimes in these games. So I, I do something and I'm really happy. I'm like, great, I figured this out. And then I just go barreling into the side of something. The zero... Zero attention to, I guess, uh, survivability. Ooh, what's this? Oh, that's part of the, that's the mobile vehicle docking bay. I could, I could recognize that from a mile away. Not really, but, you know. It's a saying. Not really. That, that doesn't make any sense. I don't even know where I'm going with this. This is going to be one interesting episode, that's for sure. So we're still on the prawn hunt. Um, we want some giant prawns, uh, right now. And we want them cheap, but that's not going to happen, so we're just going to have to hold off on that. You know, something that I do wonder, though, is whether or not we could increase the depth of this thing. Because if we could increase the depth of this thing, it would make my life so much easier. So we need to... We need to ooh, what's this? We, 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 need, we need a couple things. Ooh, Cyclops engine. So maybe we can get the Cyclops if we, uh... Forgot that's also a thing that we need to get. The Prawn and the Cyclops. I would... I would laugh if I end up finding the Prawn before the Cyclops, because... The Cyclops has so much less things for us to find. Um... Hmm... You know... I just really don't know... I have zero bearings of this realm. And... Obviously, there's a lot of uh, ways to figure out where you are, but, you know, I'm an idiot, and I don't pay attention a lot, surprisingly. Uh, I mean, I, I do pay attention to landmarks and stuff like that, but a lot of the other stuff... What's that? I just don't really pay attention. This is cool. So we have one bar to the Cyclops engine. I think we have two more pieces of Cyclops after the engine to go. Okay, so everything is flying away right now, which is interesting. Um, hmm. Oh, we're here. Okay. What just exploded on me? What, what are you? Reinforced dive suit. Hmm. Um, reinforced dive suit. That probably, what, reduces damage taken or something? I don't know. Can I, can I scan these things? I'm so, in, I'm so intrigued in what this is. Of course not. Um. Like. You. Come here. Come here, biter. J for, for biting me, you're gonna get scanned. How, how do you like that? Ooh, massive energy signature. I don't know what that is. I don't like that. Let's get in our safety bubble. Okay, well let's just keep moving. Um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna hug this thing a little close because... Massive energy readings cannot mean anything good. That is... Oh my god! Why is he in the ground? Can I scan it? I have a terrible idea. Nope. This is a great idea. 
Don't, don't, don't worry about it. Oh, I'm almost dead. Oh, I need that. So, he, he hurts if I touch him. Hmm. How am I... Ooh, a building. Where am I? Eh. Ow. This is the most important thing in this game. Is scanning this big thing, which could easily kill me. Let's go back to our ship. Okay, let's uh... Let's go back over here. Come here, friend. Oh boy. I can only get little bits. Oh god. Oh, oh no. No. Stop! That's not yours! Stop it! I'm dead. Or not. Ooh. I'm so close. This is a... Just a... Terrible idea. I'm really enjoying myself. Okay. I have him scanned. Now let's... Audi. Right now. Right. Now. Oh god. Oh. Well. Machine is not worth my life. Let's leave. I'll be very surprised if I survive this. Bye, thing. Bye. You know... I'm not too worried about that at all. We found land. We found a building. And, we, and I'm almost out of water. What? Why is everything trying to kill me? Everything is trying to kill. Where am I? Where on earth am I? So I'm almost dead. I'm really far away from everything. Hmm. Wow. Um. This game. This game just gets better and better. And I, this, that doesn't mean being facetious at all. Like, I'm serious. This game keeps getting better and better. Wow. So now I know that's a big thing that I have to tussle with. Um. Okay. Well, we got to get back somehow. Not sure how. What's this purple glowy thing? What I'm interested in. I wonder if you can kill that thing. A purple artifact. Huh. Can I drop it? And scan it? Let's scan that, please. Well, thank God I brought so many extra... Is there a map or something that I can make in this game? Because I'm never going to find th this ever again. Boop. Artifact terminal. So I'm guessing I put a purple rune in there. Or a purple artifact or whatever it's called. Um, I'm almost dead, so... Let's uh, pick you up. Um, how do I remove... Uh, how... Oh, come on. Oh my god. This is killing me. Um, hmm. What? Oh, there. Just left click. Oh, nice. Just empty, uh, empty thing. Is this smart? Probably not. Where am I? So here's, here's another... Scans indicate this structure is comprised of metal alloy. So what stuff is going to be in here just to kill me? Hmm. Message. What does the message read? Um. Un unidentified. Craft in orbit of this planet. Ooh. Data terminal. Ooh. What's that green stuff down there? Oh, I shouldn't jump. I'm jumping. I'm jumping. Um, ion crystal. Hmm. Where am I? 
This is so cool. It's like it looks like Greek key patterns everywhere. I am so dead. Putting that out there. There's no way I'm gonna be able to get back to home base. But you know what? That's just part of the fun. Um, you know what? Let's save real quick. Um you know, losing that Seamoth is really not the end of the world because you know, I just I get to Data downloads alien schematic. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. This this is this is bad. So what do I need? I need another purple artifact. Well, um, let's get out of here. I'm assuming the same way as I went up. And let's get back to home base. I want to get back to home base. Let's make another thing of hickey. We're coming back here. We're exploring. Because now I am thoroughly interested in this game, and I have some I have some things to things to read. So you know what? I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go head back to the thing. Uh, back to home base. I'm going to um, just get out of here. Get back home. Hopefully. Hopefully I can make it back. Um, get back. Um, and then I'm going to make a new Seamoth. Or is it Seamoth? Yeah, it is. Anyways, thank you guys. Why, why am I ending off the episode? I don't need to end off the episode. This is somewhere cool. Anyways, I will be right back. Bye. Oh, thank God. Daytime. Hey everyone, so, got a little message. I made it back alive, got food, um, somehow. So I, I just decided to speed that up a little bit, because, you know, not too worried about it. So we got a little thing for you, um, so this guy is the one that's coming in to land and help us out, but he's probably gonna get shot down. So okay, so we need to go in, we need to make another sea moth, because that thing is so helpful, it's not even funny. So let's uh, grab this, let's put this here, and let's go in. So that was really cool, that thing we saw, and I'm excited to explore more, but we're going to need better, better everything. We need, we need a food source, we need med source, and other stuff, so prawn suit. We need a titanium ingot, two glass, and a lubricant. Huh. That is significantly easier to make than I remembered. So let's go check out here. Titanium ingot is 10. Nothing. And then a lubricant. I think I still have one. So I got some fiber mesh. I want to say I have a lubricant, but if I don't, I know how to get it. I want to say it's either creep vine or creep vine seed clusters, and I should check before I, you know, jump 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Um, lubricant. Got any of you? No. Um, these guys, full batteries. Awesome. No worries there. Um, and now let's, let's make ourselves a titanium ingot. And then let's check and see what it is to make loop again. Actually, you know what? I just, I wanted to come back to um, do that real quick. Um, uh, three seed, creep vine seed clusters. I wanted to come back to um, 
real quick to just have that video play because I don't like doing stuff that's story like before the um, before things are done and uh, not before things are done uh, off camera because you know it might say something important and I'd want to make sure that um, that that gets in the video so yeah anyways I'm gonna get this built and I'll see you guys in a second again yeah bye hey everyone uh welcome I uh where did it go oopsies my keyboard isn't connected I should probably fix that um I made a seamoth I ran the other direction I looked over at my uh capture computer and I was out of space um that hasn't happened to me in such a long time anyways I guess word to the wise of always pay attention to how much space you have because it's never ever ever enough also I should probably just record to a giant hard drive versus a 250 gig SSD but you know what's the point of uh being smart um let's um grab some batteries just replace uh things you might as well do do something it's uh mm -hmm, mm -hmm. access battery charger I, I will I will do that charge some batteries up uh do I have any power cells I do not I realized that because I destroyed my thing any but um I just I needed something to end it off uh because you know that all happened uh you know what I know what we could do I wonder what the um what the also I saw that this blueprint thing it shows us how close we are to each thing which is awesome so let's see um here it is this is all the stuff that we got. So we got the Reaper Leviathan. So I kind of, I just wanted to read through this guy just to see what it is. So Leviathan class predators are vast organisms at the top of their respective food chains. This species is a streamlined hunter with developed sight and echolocation capability. The deep roar emitted by the Reaper at regular intervals is effectively sonar. If you hear it, the Reaper can hear you. Four powerful mandibles, this Leviathan is capable of locking prey in place and drawing it within reach of its jaws. Simulated pressure exceeds Seamoth crush resistance. Scanned specimen measured 55 meters long. Observed circling its prey and attacking from behind. This creature is almost all muscle. No brain, no sense of morality. Just muscle, sinew, and teeth. Prey. Everything. Predators. Mystery. Motivational note. This life form has been categorized as Leviathan class predator. Congratulations on getting close enough to scan it and living to see the results. Assessment. Extreme threat. So, you know what's awesome? Is that I realized that I didn't even die once while scanning that thing. Which was probably really dumb of me, but it's off that way somewhere. Rabbit Ray jumping, but we didn't even die once. Also, they fixed something with the lighting to where you can see stuff under the water, and it just it looks so pretty. I really love this game. It's so much fun. Huh? I'm kind of low on food. Let's go. Let's do that. Yay! I love the diving. That that's such a that's such a cool little f um. Come here. Come here, peeper. Now I can grab you. Yay. Let's grab some more peepers and go cook them up because I am hungry. Wait, I already have some... I already have some stuff in the, in the thing. I wonder what the best way to hold food is. I don't think I really have a way to store food yet. Let's make some cooked peepers. And one more. I don't know. Anyways, um, I wanted to say thank you guys for watching, and, uh, okay, so the bladder fishes do get old. Um, you know what? Eh. Whatever. Um, let's just do that. I might as this thought I might as well get rid of them. And then, you know what? That, that, that'll, that'll be it for today. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching, and next time we will... Next time we will continue exploring um well i don't know where exactly we'll explore but we're just going to con continue exploring because i think our next our next mode of business is to increase the depth on this guy because if we can increase the depth on this guy then it just makes our life infinitely easier so yeah let's uh let's uh let's do that so anyways thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video where i will be fully uh full of sustenance and I will, that was probably the weirdest sentence I've ever said. I will be, um, full of stuff and 
we can continue exploring. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Uh, this was a very uh, interesting video that was very, uh, you know, I was not expecting that. I'll just put it that way. And uh, I'm happy we found one of the biggest things in the ocean. But I guess the even scarier part for me is that I know that's not the biggest thing in the ocean. There's, there's going to be more. There is going to be more. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!